man, I was thinking about my love for theology. Like, it's so crazy. So I I remember at 16 years old when I first joined um, this church called West End Mount Carmel. Uh, just an amazing season in my life. Amazing leader, amazing friendships and people there. And I uh, just, I threw myself in this new spirit of life. Like I was just so filled with joy to make so many new friends. My partner James Westbrook, the dude who's doing like all the cover art for my Extra No series. Uh, that's my bro, you feel me? Like we go back. Uh, I met him. Uh, Dizzle, JR, do season, you know what I'm saying? Like, just good dudes, good people. Nab, like, all of us was at the same church, you feel me? And it was just a, an amazing time, but I just remember loving reading my Bible, loving um, scripture and Bible study, just getting together, talking about the Lord, what he was doing in our lives. Like, we just all, like, straight in the hood, just celebrating Jesus. It was super simple, man, and... Um, Yes, yeah, so I think about that. And then, you know, and once I found out about uh, CHH or gospel rap is how we used to refer to it back then. <laughs> when I found out about that cross movement, oh my goodness, like I just, I felt at home, you know what I mean? And then I found a magazine somewhere, I guess I got it from the Christian bookstore or something like that. And it, it was an article in there about the ambassador and it was talking about how he was in Bible college. And I was just thinking like, you can go to college and study the Bible? Like I didn't even know that was a thing, you know what I'm saying? So like, I was like, oh, that's that's me. Like it just felt like an instant connection with that, you know, and uh, which was already consistent with the joy that was in my heart for the word of God, right? And then, uh, yeah, eventually I, I uh, enrolled and I became a student and uh yeah I was just able to study and dive into God's word it was just a beautiful season and uh and ex a season that has extended throughout the current days of my life I just I find so much joy in studying God's word studying church history just seeing what Christians have thought throughout the ages respecting their contribution um though they are with the Lord Right. Many brothers and sisters who just belabored to um, communicate as best they could God's word to defend the Christian faith. Like I honor that. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I honor that commitment that they gave. They have they have the same Holy Spirit we do. We do. And they lived in a complicated, complex world. And just with the angst of their society, they were still trusting God and, um, you know, diving into his word and defending the faith, you know, so I, I love to think about being a part of that legacy through my music and, um, and it's just, it enhances my joy and I get to serve my neighbor. I get to serve all the people that listen to my music and they get to just at least be exposed to things that maybe they haven't perhaps at their local church or just on their Christian journey. I get to bring these things to the fore. So really that's just my heart. My heart is just to, you know, uh, share good theology um, try to practice the humility to admit if I believe I was wrong. And um, yeah, just try to push myself and us towards considering more broadly as opposed to thinking inside of an echo chamber and only hearing amens from the people that say the same things that we do. I just, I just love, you know, not necessarily scouring for anything new or novel. I like going back to seeing... Uh, as close and as best I can what the scriptures actually say and what our brothers and sisters have thought about it throughout the ages and it's just a joy so I love putting it in music I love talking about it through social media and I just you know what I'm saying I thank y'all for y'all patience and just going there with me and enjoying the ride so um yeah so anyway just reflecting on that and I'm thinking about this book coming next year like I can't wait to just bring y'all into that so anyway um, yeah, let us continue to dig and to grow in the grace and knowledge of the Lord. You feel me? <laughs>